What is up, everybody? Jared 333 Life Sky, make sure you match that link in the description, son. So, yesterday I uh, was watching Rywin's live stream. He has some nice music on there. You know, he said he don't want any beef, but he did point out a video of mine he didn't like. Uh, and he said he wasn't going to subscribe because I post 10 times a day. <clears throat> well, that's true. But, uh, that don't mean you can't subscribe, son. So, I was also watching the Dane live stream a little bit yesterday, and I was also watching Woodward TV also last night. So, he was talking actually on the phone on the Dane live stream with, uh, you know, Dane, I guess that was his name. And he was saying, uh, someone was saying he treats his subscribers like shit, you know. But when I went on his live stream, it wasn't that he was treating me like like crap, you know, that's just how he was talking. Like he was just telling it like it is. Some people do that. A lot of people don't like it when you tell it like it is because they don't want to hear or they don't want to hear or think about what you're actually thinking. Because, you know, everybody most people are gonna think some BS, you know what I'm saying? So he said there was a video I posted where I was looking in the window. And, uh, there was a nail salon I was looking in and at these Asian women and uh, you, you know and I was doing that I was looking in with the phone at the, the, the Asian the people in the thing and there happened to be women inside I was standing in line when the, there was huge lines for the you know the COVID lines when you, people were going like one in at a time in the stores because they were counting the people they said the fire the fire people were counting, you know, the people inside of the stores. So you go in one line, and so I got my camera, and I was recording inside of the, the nail salon, and I put in the title, oh, checking out some Asian women or something like that, and then I changed it later to, you know, waiting in line or something, which is true, yeah, but they're not children. I can, I can stare at women. I'm allowed to stare at women. You know, some people say, oh, you're a creep or whatever. The way women dress nowadays, 90% of men that are not, that are, 90% of men that are straight are going to stare at women because they have, you know, their, their uh, chest hanging out. And they have their ass hanging out, you know what I mean? And it's sometimes hard not to. I'm not saying that the, these Asian women, Asian women inside the store did. Like I said, I was waiting in line. I was gonna look inside their glass doors, regardless of who's inside. I just named it weird to be funny, and I changed it back because people were already acting stupid, like they do. So anyways, he said he wants to hang out and all this stuff. His thoughts were really scattered. His thoughts were kinda everywhere. Like I said, this is not a big video. This is me telling him like it is just like Ryan likes doing. So, I don't know if this guy gets much sleep, but his thoughts were literally all over the place. And uh, he was saying, you wanna hang out? And you guys go check out the video, you know, go, go subscribe to him, you know, he's a, he's a good uh, uh, YouTuber, whatever. And then uh, he was saying, I don't know if I wanna hang out with you. And, uh, like he's literally saying everything that he's thinking, which is all over the place. And then he, he uh, kind of says that he reminds, I remind him of Hampton Brandon in that video. But Hampton Brandon ain't on my power level, you know what I'm saying? I seen this one video where uh, Crazy Temple goes, runs up on Hampton Brandon. Like, yeah, Hampton Brandon wasn't expecting it, but, you know, he made Hampton Brandon look bad. I'm on, like, kind of like a Crazy Temple power level, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's a little bit higher than Hampton Brandon's. Even though he's kind of bold, you know what I'm saying? He's bold and he's gonna, you know, maybe do some stupid things. He says, you know, balls or whatever. Anyways, let me change the subject real quick. I want to talk about the Woodward TV. He would, Woodward, Woodward TV was talking about the people on his live stream. He was talking about the people on his video talking because he's been talking about the book of Enoch 
And yeah, I hadn't heard that before where he said about the bulls was ahead of Enoch's time. And even the book of Enoch does correlate with the Bible like 100%, except it does give more detail. Anyway, I want to say something to Warrior TV. He may or may not be watching this. I'm 100% sure he knows who I am, though. Um, there are people on his channel that are on drugs that think they know everything. And there are people that are just playing stupid out there that are just going to say anything on on the comment section. So, you know, don't let the people get you mad. And I know he's not mad, but he was just he was just saying to us that, you know, he's going to kick them out. And like, it's kind of like detoxing and all this stuff. So, yeah, people think that they know everything when they're on drugs. You see what I'm saying? Some people that are watching also this video, they're, they're just playing stupid people. And... Um, they think that, you know, who knows, maybe they might be, you know, smarter one day and they're watching it for whatever reason still, they're interested. But, you know, there's always gonna, you're always gonna have stupid comments, man. I just leave them there for someone else to say something to, you know what I mean? Uh, it's all good, because sometimes the people are trolling also. You can't tell if somebody's trolling in the comments. Um, or if they're just plain stupid. So, you know, just leave it. I just leave the comments up. He said, oh, delete, I delete some of the comments that are just plain stupid. Well, you know, and whatever floats your boat, you know, that's good for you. So, uh, yeah, whatever TV I watched his video yesterday, he came out with a part two of the Enoch video. And yeah, I remember the Giants, uh, Nephilim's, they called them out as a different type of animal. In the book of Enoch, he was referring to the people of Moses' day as sheep, and then the wolves were the, uh, you know, the Egyptians, and the, the wolves were the people going after God's people. But, you know, nowadays it just, in our Bible, it just, it'll just say it, like, the, you know, the humans and the people, God's people, the chosen people, and stuff like that. It kind of different, you know, terminology. But um, you know, it's a good book. You know, it tells you like a, like like Woodward TV says, and like I say, it it doesn't have any inconsistencies with the Bible at all. In fact, the Bible says that Enoch prophesied, but nowhere in the Bible does it say where he prophesied. But it's in the whole book of Enoch. Look it up. Enoch prophesied. It's in the Bible. Anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed this video. Like, subscribe, and share. Check out links in the description. Peace out.